What's going on people? Welcome back to Curtis Shaw TV, back with another transfer video and we have got the defender we have been chasing for days and days and weeks. It's been a saga going on and on. Fabrizio Romano, reliable journalist, one of the best transfer journalists you know, in world football. He has confirmed it is done. It will be completed on Monday. He will fly into London on Monday to sign the paperwork. Total agreement between clubs and player, uh, everything done, five-year contract and 30 million euros plus add-ons. So you're looking around 25 million pounds. Um, you know, I think his head was turned slightly in the week. Manchester United jumped in at the last minute. Napoli have been pushing hard to get the deal done. Of course, Napoli um, were trying to move Koulibaly on. They haven't been able to sell him. Uh, apparently, they're struggling for cash until they actually get rid of him. So that was causing them a delay. Um, I've been reading a little bit about this. Um, it's saying that Gabriel had his heart set on a move to the Premier League and that Arsenal was the club he was always looking to join. He's been convinced by the manager, Mikel Arteta. He's been convinced by Edu, of course, uh, Brazilian and, uh, you know, we've got a, a little core of Brazilian players now at the club. You look at the likes of Willian, David Luiz, you've got Gabriel Martinelli. Of course, if um, Gabriel comes in as well, that'll be the quartet. Um, and Edu, of course, who, who has a big role at Arsenal now. Now, I think this is a real coup for Arsenal now. I'm not going to pretend to be some expert on Gabriel. I've seen him play a couple of times. I've seen a lot of highlights of him now, as I think we all have... Um, you know, I'm sure we've all typed his name in on YouTube over the past two weeks. But I think, you know, he sounds very highly rated. Um, you listen to people who've played against him, played with him. He got in the uh, Ligue 1 team of the season um, next to Thiago Silva. And, you know, the fact that Manchester United, PSG have come in at the last minute and we've still managed to convince him, listen, this is the club for you to come to. Despite the fact we have no Champions League football, you know, the rumours also state that Napoli offered him more wages. So if his head was purely on money, then, you know, he could have gone elsewhere and got more money. I know Arsenal fans have been very frustrated over the past few days. You know, it's a saga that's been continuing on and on. Even me making videos about it, I've been like, oh man, like, do I want to make another video about it? But we've got him. He will fly in on Monday. He will complete everything there. Apparently, the medical has already um, started over there in France. He was apparently in attendance at the Lille game um, they played um, on Saturday. Um, and, you know, it's a great, great um, acquisition for Arsenal. I actually just watched the boxing. Um, Dillian White, man, got knocked out by Povetkin. Devastating uppercut that knocked him out, man. Unbelievable. And, um, you know, Arsenal have delivered the knockout blow on Manchester United. So, you know, it, it, it just shows the power that Arsenal have got at times. You know, we haven't got the money of Man United. And you would think with them being in the Champions League, they could have come in at the last minute and maybe taken him away from us. But we've proved our worth. We've shown that Saliba, Gabriel could be a very good, exciting centre-back partnership for Arsenal going into next season. Gabriel is a gooner. He will join next week. He will fly into London on Monday and the deal will be completed. Saga over. We can relax now. Let's just sit back, enjoy it, wait for the announcement. A Bamian contract will be done as well. No worries there. And um, a good time to be a gooner onwards and upwards from the FA Cup win. So everyone, subscribe to the channel. Thanks for all your brilliant support. You know, I'm doing videos at midnight now. You know, as I said, I just finished watching the boxing and what a fight that was. And um, Arsenal have delivered the knockout blow on Manchester United and Napoli. Subscribe to the channel. Subscribe to the channel. Um, let me know what you think, Gabriel. What you know? What partnership should it be him and Saliba, two young players? Should we play one of the experienced heads next to him? Let me know what you think in the comments down below. And I'll be back later in the week. Come on, you Gunners. Bless.